Hey guys, it's me, Shondell, the creator of The Craft Print. If you're here for this video, more than likely you've purchased my earring hanger rack and you're just here to see how to assemble it. So, thank you so much for your purchase. I hope you really enjoy my rack. I enjoy creating it for you. So you're going to get these first two pieces. I've already glued the stabilizing little rectangles on the bottom for you. You're going to get these two pieces, which I've already glued together for you as well. And then the steps to put it together is really simple. You should also have in your box your hangers. Don't forget this little piece to actually hang the things on. These are two small side rectangles. You can put your earrings on them too. There goes your little hangers. Isn't it cute in a little packaging? But anyway, so let's go straight to assembling. It's really simple. So I hope you're not stressed out when you saw that it came in pieces. So you're gonna stand up the two side panels and the little squares on the side of that panel, you wanna make sure that is facing up. Now you're gonna put them side to side. Right here I have it facing in, but those squares you want on the outside. So the glued pieces that I put on there, you want them facing the outside. Now that piece that I just picked up, which is the bottom one, you're gonna just slide it into the two pieces. As you can see, I'm having a little trouble from the way I was holding it, but it's really simple. So you wanna put that on, or you can have someone holding them to stand up and then just slide it in. So the other side, you're literally just fitting it into the groove and sliding it down. The reason why I look like I'm stumbling because it's just me you know, working, putting that thing together myself. So you slip it down and there you have it. Those little pieces on the edge kind of stabilize it to stand up on its own. Step one. Now you're going to put the pieces. Oh, let me just show you this glue. You can glue it onto that and then press it down just for extra stability. If you know you're not gonna break it apart again to maybe move it somewhere else, but if you know you're gonna keep it assembled, you can just glue it down. So the hanger rack piece, it fits real snug. Just slide it right there on the top. The next piece, you'll see it has four little holes I glue the um, framing piece for you. Just slip them right in to the point on the top of the rack. You see the structure? Really simple. Then your side pieces on the hooks that are towards the bottom, you're just going to place them and slide them right in. Also, this little piece you can use to um, hang like really small studs it's really cute i didn't actually hang anything on mine but anyway that's besides the point also when you're hanging your jewelry if you're going to use really heavy earrings try not to hang them in the middle of the hanger rack hang them more towards the ends because it can weigh the acrylic down a little bit so that's it now your hanger rack is fully assembled Thank you so much for purchasing from the craft print. Now let me show you how to slide your hanger. You're gonna lean it sideways, hook it, and then turn it straight. And then your hanger goes on. And it's really simple to add the earrings. You will have to, you can add, guys, I don't know why I'm tongue tied, excuse me, but y'all know me by now, right? If you don't follow the craft print on Instagram, you'll see more of my craziness. Anyway, before I got tongue tied, I was trying to tell you that you can put any type of earring, whether it's a hoop, it's a, a pierced earring, even though the hanger space, it looked like it has like a space in between the hanger. I'll show you guys and give you an example of two different types of earrings that you can hang on there and it's going to stay. Also, the top of the rack can fit small items also. It has a little um, border and it can hold small things. And on the bottom too, if you wanna place something on the bottom rack, it's perfectly fine. And let me get the two earrings for you guys and show you how to put it on the hanger. Look at how cute that is. You see the little grooves I was talking about? Right there. You still can hang any type of jewelry on that piece. Hold on. Okay, I said hold on like y'all was right in front of me. But anyway, y'all understand what I was saying. So I have a pair of hoops and I'm gonna show you. Of course it was out of frame, but I'm gonna bring it back for you. So you just hook it on there, it'll hang. Even though I try to turn it sideways for you guys to see what I'm talking about, just hook it in between those two little, I guess, spikes, you would call it. Hmm. But turn your hanger sideways, put it in there, and then hook it. If you're using hoops like that, just see 
how much space it takes up on the rack also because it's not sideways. So if you want to avoid, maybe you just hook the earring right there. But then that would like take away from the cute aesthetic, right? Anyway, so for your earrings that are for like pierced ears, you want to put it right through those little hoops and clip the backing on it. It's not going to fall out. It's going to hang just like that. Simple, simple, simple and cute. I really love this rack. I hope you guys enjoy it too, seriously. So you just hook it on and there you have it. So it's a little lopsided, as you can see, because I only have one earring on, so it's weighing down the one side. Again, if you have really heavy earrings, hang them toward the front and the back of the rack, because when you hang it in the center, it'll kind of droop down. Now, again, if you're here, more than likely you purchased the rack from my Etsy shop and you're just here to assemble. So thank you again for your purchase. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at the craft print and subscribe here on YouTube. You may not be a crafter, but you can enjoy a lot of craft projects. So thank you so much for your purchase. I hope you enjoy and don't forget to tag me as well when you put together your earrings on this rack.